if you've clicked on this video then i'm assuming you are a bit tensed whether solutions like chat gpt google bard or the advances that are happening in vision as well as large language models will it affect your job this video is about my thoughts in terms of how these solutions are changing how the industry works whether your job is safe or not is what you will get an answer through this video so without wasting any further time let's kick start the video so here is a challenge for you and i'm pretty sure i'll win the challenge have you so far used chat gpt or any other ai service and i'm pretty sure the answer that you would give is an astounding yes solutions like chat gpt google bard stable diffusion have slowly steadily made our way in how we create our solutions whether you are in hr whether you are in finance whether you are in accounting whether you are in supply chain or any other business vertical there is a definite buzz around ai and how ai is impacting your domain does that mean your job is in threat well we'll try to break it down let me start off with a simple example the banking industry that we know of today was fully manual back in 1960 or 1970 computers came in very late people used to write down every entry manually and then save it into the bank accounts imagine the amount of transactions that we do today if that had to be kept manual would it be scalable with the amount of population that is growing every year would that solution be scalable no right which is where once accounting softwares came in or banking softwares came in there was a good amount of resistance that the bank employees showed thinking that their jobs would be removed have their jobs been removed no right you still find people in the bank right so the idea is when technology is first presented to you there is good amount of resistance that people show because they fear that that particular technology or solution will take away their jobs there are fields of automation where chat gpt and the other solutions can kind of take away the jobs that is a fact which you have to embrace by hook or crook because chat gpt is designed in such a way that If you are doing a task continuously one after the other in a manual mode then chat gpt kind of aims to eliminate the entire manual process and kind of automate the entire end to end pipeline right so if there are things that you're doing continuously and if it's not a value add and if you feel a machine can kind of do it better then technically your job is in threat there is no two ways about it but if you are in a niche field or if you if you're not even in the niche field but if you're doing something if there is human touch that is expected in the solution then technically your job is still safe when it comes to software engineers there's a lot of talk about say duet ai from google or github copilot where these two solutions or there are multiple other solutions as well where they can kind of create the entire code for you is that a threat for software engineering my answer is not at this point even till now what the software engineer has to do is understand the requirements from a product manager translate that into something that is already existing so if there is a legacy code base that already exists then which modules have to be changed what changes do i have to make is where manual intervention comes in can chat gpt or other solutions help in writing code definitely yes these solutions can definitely guide you in terms of giving you the skeleton of what code is required but can they do everything for you and understand the entire code base my answer right now is no so a lot of companies have legacy code base which i'm pretty sure companies wouldn't want to push out that data into any server and kind of then generate code which is where some snippets of code if you create using say uh, code generating softwares that is perfectly fine but can it replace the entire solution the answer is no till this point of time okay when i talk about data scientist i believe data science is a very broad term and when i have to speak about whether the job of a data scientist is safe at this point given solutions like vertex ai have auto ml built in given large language models are becoming smarter by the day is the job really in threat well the answer is no data science has a human touch to it which is called as business understanding 
if you are well versed with business if you understand business nitty gritties really well and if you can translate business problems into ml problems then you are on that cream layer of data science where you don't have to worry about the job but you have to thrive and give impact to your organization in such cases literally there is no need for you to worry about whether solutions like chat gpt or other solutions can take away your job my answer is no because that human touch in terms of understanding business problems and then translating into an analytical solution requires a lot of skills which at this point is not something that these solutions have kind of developed going forward there might be a day where large language models can do everything and till that day arrives where llms also understand business context really well till that time your jobs are safe what would be my advice if you are worried about your job security my advice would be to keep upskilling yourself don't shy away from these technologies like chat gpts of the world google bards of the world stable diffusions of the world don't shy away from these technologies in fact what i have done is i've started using these technologies to my advantage if there are snippets of code that i want to generate say graphs or if there are snippets of code that i want to quickly create a flask api or a fast api based endpoint then i quickly create the skeleton using these solutions then scale it based on the exact set of requirements that i have this is how i use generative ai in my workflow so as an individual if you are worried about the generative ai wave don't sit back and look at the wave and be scared of it in fact hop on to that wave and enjoy the entire sailing on that particular wave when you start sailing with the latest wave then you don't have to worry about the job market enjoy the offers that come out once you start creating solutions using that particular wave in nature so there was a deep learning wave there was an ml wave and currently we are in the gen ai wave ride this particular wave use the solutions that exist to your betterment if you are learning say lead code and if you are practicing data structures and algorithms if you are stuck somewhere in terms of understanding a solution take that piece of code put it into chat gpt or any other large language model and understand the explanation behind that particular code once you start doing this once you start building a habit you won't be scared of generative ai in fact you will start using generative ai to your betterment so this is a video that i wanted to create for solutions or for jobs where manual intervention is not required and if you ask yourself can this task that i'm doing can this be done by a machine better then if you get an answer which is yes then sadly there are chances that your job might go away which is where you have to be prepared for something else and you should discover ways in which how you can kind of use generative ai and make your own portfolio better so i hope this gave you a clear picture in terms of how the overall landscape is and i hope you like this video as well and it, uh, hopefully you found this video informative if you do like the content that i create on my channel then please 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 make it a point to subscribe to my channel so that i can reach out to you with such amazing videos in the future as well thank you so much for watching the video